when I say that I want to connect to a sheet, I mean that I, I want Power Query to look at the entire sheet and be able to decide what's the region that has the data. And that is our very first challenge. If we are connecting to sheets, regardless of being within the same file or not, we need to make sure that, for example, I don't type something here and then I delete it or I leave some kind of formatting there. Because then Power Query will consider that that cell, the last cell of this sheet with data, and will consider all the range until then. And so we will have to deal with extra columns that are empty and we don't want them. So that's one of the difficulties of connecting to sheets. It's much easier when we are connecting to tables or defined ranges with names that we can identify the name of the range. So if you have a situation like this, I, I recommend you that you do something like this. You select the first empty column, control shift uh, right arrow right, to select until the very last XFD column and then come here in the home tab clear clear all this will delete any formats any content that might have been forgotten there and same thing do this until the very last row so control shift down arrow uh, select the first empty row first and then clear clear all so that we are sure that only these cells are utilized in, within this sheet and do that for all the other sheets with data. Okay, so that's the first uh, tip here if you are connecting two sheets.